Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today we will be discussing what we know so far about the upcoming Rugby Challenge 4 game. So going back to September 2019, the Rugby Challenge announced on their Facebook page that they were going to be releasing the next instalment, Rugby Challenge 4, in December of 2019. However, at the beginning of December, the game was pushed back with no confirmed release date, just that it would be sometime in 2020. Around a month later, they began to post images on their Facebook of some of their confirmed licensed teams that would appear on Rugby Challenge 4. Firstly, World Cup runners-up England, and then Australia, New Zealand, Fiji, and finally the world champion South Africa. Whilst it was great to get a look at the impressive graphics in Rugby Challenge 4, we were yet to see any gameplay, and we still had no official release date. At the end of February, however, Rugby Challenge 4 released a teaser trailer, which was made up of 15 seconds of players walking out onto the pitch, and two seconds of Ford scoring a try. One key thing we noticed from the trailer, however, was the new engine that would be used, Unreal Engine. Uh, they're responsible for some of the biggest recent games, such as Fortnite and Days Gone. A couple of days ago, a trailer was released for the new AFL game, which is made by the same company as Rugby Challenge 4, True Blue, and uses the Unreal Engine. We'll leave the link in the description, so check it out if you want a glimpse of what Rugby Challenge 4 could look like. After another month of silence, Rugby Challenge finally posted an update to confirm Super Rugby will be appearing on the game. Whilst this is positive news, this may have confirmed that we won't be seeing any European competitions on the game, such as Gallica Premiership, Pro 14. As on their website, they state over 25 teams, the international and Super Rugby teams, totalling over 20 teams. Whilst there's still no official release date, it was thought that Rugby Challenge 4 will be released between the start of April and the end of June. Recent photos from Wicked Witch on their Facebook page have shown their developers continuing to work on the game despite the lockdown, so hopefully the game shall be released fairly soon. Please let us know your thoughts and what you'd like to see in the upcoming Rugby Challenge 4. And if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please like and subscribe and let us know what content you'd like to see.